But the San Francisco institution burned down early this morning. This historic double play bar and grill had been serving drinks since 1909. Some people consider it a baseball shrine because it was the go to spot when the old Seal Stadium was across the street. KPX 5's Don Lynn spoke with the owner and has the latest on the fire. The fire destroyed more than just a bar, it destroyed a lot of history. Double play is sort of like a time capsule that had a lot of memorabilia that dated back to the Seal Stadium days. Firefighters got the 911 calls around 5 o'clock early in the morning. It was fully engulfed in flames. Been declared a working fire location, 16th and Bryant. They believe the fire started in the front by the bar area. It's destroyed along with the memorabilia. The back dining room has heavy water and smoke damage. I come to war, I see fire fires and I come and see everything is done. Owner Rafael Hernandez found out about the fire when he came to work six in the morning. Looks like I can't stop no believe it. I see, but I cannot believe it. Still in shock. Yeah. Rafael says he can't put his pain into words because double play was his life. Spent 34 years here. Started both as a dishwasher and a cook in 1988. He bought it from the previous owner 14 years ago. I grew up here basically. First party, baby shower party, graduation. I've had almost every major event here with my dad in the kitchen, usually cooking food. I'd be lost for the community, for the whole history they got inside before. Double Play opened in 1909, but before it was a neighborhood bar in the Mission and a frequent hangout spot for firefighters and first responders, it was a popular bar and shrine for baseball fans. Seal Stadium was across the street. The first baseline did come out of the first base. There was a door there. You could see it in the picture. They'd come over here and get a shot. I mean, have a shot of whiskey while they're playing baseball. This is one of the first games I, I believe played by the San Francisco Giants at Seal Stadium, and it's against the Dodgers. The Giants and Willie Mays played two seasons at the stadium when they moved from New York to San Francisco. The stadium was demolished in 1959. Some of the old parts were kept as memorabilia at double play. A seat from the Seal Stadium, a little foam piece, that it burned down. The top of the, the flagpole from Seal Stadium, yeah. Now, I hope, I don't know what happened. It was on a plaque. Woody May signed it. The refreshment stand sign taken from Seal Stadium did not survive. All the old autographed pictures also gone. I'm sad. I just really, I just, oh yeah. Sorry, there's not more, man. Firefighter salvaged an old bat and handed it to Rafael. He says he would like to rebuild if possible. Firefighters are still investigating the cause of the fire. They say it's too early to tell how it all started. In San Francisco, I'm Da Lynn, KPIX 5. There are two stories of apartments above double play. Those apartments were under renovation, but nobody was living in them.